I'm Joe Smith and I'm 19. I'm Liam O'Keefe and I'm 19. And we both study at West Knox College. Well, we both met here at college because we, we were both in the same class, which is music technology. And we both, I, did, I came and I didn't really know anyone. And uh, we're both the same age, like compared to the other people in our class who were like 17 at the time. Like, 16. 16 at the time and then, yeah, that was it. Yeah. <laughs> the rest is history. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> what inspired me to make music? Well, uh, I, had a, I got a guitar and then started playing a bar, started to learn how to play it. And when I thought I was good enough to start writing songs, I started. And uh, Luckily, I was at college and I asked Liam if he could help me record it here, and then that was it. Showed you the songs you liked him. Yeah, we would, well, you showed me the songs uh, on guitar, and then we started yeah. to demo them and get rough versions of them down to start building up into full songs. Mm. Uh, what I do is I sing, play guitar, and write the music. I play other guitar parts, um, bass guitar, and then... Yeah, we've got Jack Lee, he plays drums for us. Yeah. For the recording and hopefully when we gig. <laughs> so the new EP is basically the songs I've been writing at home, uh, influenced by quite a few bands. I'd mainly say Palace, Palace Daughter, yeah. Alt J, yeah, I was gonna say kind Alt -J. of. It's like Alt, Palace is more like a blues, indie alternative band. So that's the style, and then we've got some atmospheric sounds like Daughter have and yeah. Alt J. I think Alt J brings more that alternative sound to yeah. it. Because it's not just straight out blues with a bit of background ambience, it's got some sort of rocky elements to it. Yeah. Me, me and Liam have a record label which is Create Records, which is college's record label, which you can find our music on, and a lot of other bands, quite good bands around there as well. So, yeah, find us on Create Records. <laughs> <laughs> music making process we go through is I'll record the songs on my phone and then send them to Liam. And Liam will listen to him and then we'll go into the mix of the mastering suite, which is just a little setup we've got at college. They can just record simple demos and we demo it and then bring it into the studio and then we add what we feel like. We do, we do the bass and stuff. So we build the tracks up with other instruments. But mostly all of them are just guitars and drums. So bass guitars, acoustic guitars, electric guitars. But it's building them up right near the parts after Joe's shows the songs will come. Sometimes we change the structure around a bit and yeah. things, change the lyrics and stuff. But it's building it up ready for the final recordings in the studio, which we're doing now. We have both evolved. Well, I've evolved. I've got better at playing guitar, really. Better at writing songs, getting structures of songs. That's what I've got better at. I think for me, my. It's a broad number of horizons, I guess is a good way of putting it. So I used to be very into rock and metal guitar like, exclusively, but now I've started delving into more bluesy stuff and other genres of music to learn a bit more. A bit better for Can't <laughs> Well, that's me, isn't it? Yeah. Telling you all the bands to listen to. It is. <laughs> The biggest challenge we have come across whilst recording. Staying focused. Wouldn't be staying <laughs> focused, yeah. We tend to the we'll go in this we'll just go we'll go into the mix and master suite and we'll both have a guitar and anything could happen. Yeah. <laughs> we just go mental sometimes, yeah. make some weird sounds. Yeah, it's not always songs or anything yeah. musical, sometimes it's just noise. Just noise. That's not really got any practical applications, but it's fun to It's a laugh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, The direction for the band would be 
Well, I want it when we're because we're both open to getting the same uni. So playing live would be good, and just playing. I don't really see fame and fortune. It'd just be a good laugh to play with you, live and Jack if you join. Yeah, it'd be well for me. Studio time's fun. Stu yeah, Gigs studio. Are fun as well, so. yeah. Because it's what we're both into, whether we're in the band or not, it's quite fun to give our own stuff a go, as well as recording other people. Yeah. It's not that I don't want to headline, because that would be sick, but... Yeah, I'm not that bothered. Uh, I don't think we take it serious enough. We yeah, yeah. Like, like, like with the focusing, we don't <laughs> sit down and pan it out or focus or anything, we just do what we want, which isn't going to get us on. <laughs> Any massive festival at any time soon. Oh, but glass fun, stuff. So, yeah. <laughs> the advice I'd give is stay motivated and just go for it. Don't be scared to get stuck in. I'd make sure it's fun as well. Yeah. Yeah, don't, yeah, don't do it if you're not enjoying it because yeah. there's no point. Because you'll just get fed up and stop. So make sure you enjoy it. <laughs> People can gain access to our music through, well, when it's recorded and finished, through Create Records, uh, SoundCloud, Bandcamp, YouTube. Um, what else is that? Vimeo. Vimeo. What else can put on? Vimeo. Um, We're committed to all these now. Uh, iTunes. <laughs> Spotify. Spotify. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Um, I'd like to say thanks to the college for letting us record for free. For and a letting, long time. For a long time. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Recording, yeah. Um, equipment, letting us use equipment. Letting us put our songs on there record which is www.createrecords.co.uk <laughs> 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 yeah, do you want to say thank you anyone but jack anyone but jack oh. it's been too many times <laughs> thank you and goodbye make sure you check out our ep on create records Oh, sounds loud.